Hi friends, welcome back to the shop. Today I just want to speak briefly about demolition screwdrivers. All right, now I looked at all types of brands from DeWalt to Harbor Freight to Milwaukee and Klein, and I selected Irwin for demolition screwdrivers. Um, and there's a set of criteria unique to this tool that, uh, and it's the same with selecting any tool that I, is why I pick these. Now, in a demolition screwdriver, what you're looking to do is, is do some prying, right? You're looking to uh, get into uh, the end here and do some striking with your hammer and uh, without damaging the screwdriver. Uh, if you have a standard screwdriver that doesn't have this shaft coming all the way through the handle to the end, you could drive the plastic handle into the shaft and damage your screwdriver, right? So that's the idea behind these. Um, now, the reason, uh, the criteria that I had, the reason I picked this screwdriver uh, was because, of course, you want the shank to come all the way through, but I also wanted uh, the uh, designation of whether the screwdriver was flat or Phillips to be on the handle of the screwdriver. And uh, here you can see, of course, it's on both. And I like the fact that they, uh, and, and it's, it's in the metal here, it's engraved in the metal, so you can actually, it's not gonna rub off, right? And you can see on this example I have here, it's just an example. Uh, here you can see this ink is rubbing off. Um, and uh, some manufacturers like uh, DeWalt, for example, or um, Milwaukee, uh, Milwaukee actually had this, but DeWalt didn't have it on theirs, nor did Klein. Um, but of course, uh, uh, Irwin did. Now, the other thing I wanted was a, a round shaft, right? What I didn't want was a hex shaft like this guy here. You can look at this example and see. And why? Because typically you can tell on these, and it lines right up with the, with the business end of the screwdriver. You have this flat edge, and then you have a sharp corner right here on these hex screwdrivers. And, you know, that results in, you know, if you're, if you're working on something and prying something, you're shoving this corner right into whatever you're working on. You're more likely to damage the work. Uh, and anytime, if I have a choice of whether you know, it's going to be round or a hex screwdriver uh, shaft, I'm going to pick round. And of course, the Milwaukee had a, a hex shaft screwdriver. Uh, price is a, cr a factor too because you know this is something you're going to beat on and tear up and abuse is the idea. Typically, when you talk about a demolition screwdriver, you're talking about a flat screwdriver. Now, this just happened to come in a, a pair uh, along with the Phillips that you know, would just see normal use. Um, but uh, uh, that's why I selected these screwdrivers. They have a, an, an excellent handle. And, and I would say that I, I also like the Klein screwdrivers. Uh, the only difference really uh, in terms of the criteria I was talking about is the Klein doesn't designate whether it's flat or Phillips on the end. And of course that matters if you're storing these tools vertically, right, with the handles up. Uh, you want to be able to look down and quickly, you know, distinguish which one you're pulling out. Uh, and uh, the, the DeWalt's did not have that. Uh, the Kleins didn't have that, um, and like I said, the Milwaukee did, but I really did like the, the Klein screwdrivers. I actually bought the Klein uh, screwdriver with a 7-inch shank and uh, just ran into an issue where it just wouldn't fit into the tool bag. It was a little bit too long, um, and since I'm talking about the length of that screwdriver, I'll just get a quick measurement here. Uh, including the handle, it looks to be about 11 and a quarter inches um, if you're looking for fitting the screwdriver into a, a certain location. But uh, with that said, just a, a quick video on demolition screwdrivers and why I pick the Irwin. Don't, I don't typically pick Irwin, uh, 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 a brand, uh, but sometimes uh, there is exceptions. And uh, I think this is a, a pretty good option. I think the Klein is also um, an excellent option too, based on the criteria here. Of course, like I said, the Klein won't have this designation on the end. So that's why these, uh, the, this set was ultimately uh, selected. So uh, with that said, please consider uh, liking and subscribing, and uh, we'll catch you on the next video.